Okay, today I'm going to show you, and it's the first time I've done this, I'm going to hook up my new Wayne PC1 water transfer pump to my newly created quote unquote solar generator. And we'll get into more. This video is not about the solar generator so much as it is connecting the PC1 water transfer pump to it. And you can do this with any battery, okay? So we're going to start out and I'm going to basically, it says to put some oil into the connections before you get started. So I'm going to do that real quick and then we'll see how it goes from there. We're going to put the vegetable oil in the inlet and the outlet. Okay, so I put oil in the inlet and the outlet and then I attached the hose and it came with the hose. And it's not a very long hose, but it works. So I attach that hose and it's got a little screen grid so when you drop it in the tank it doesn't get too much junk but you should um, if you're going to be transferring water that might have a lot of junk in it um, to go ahead and put a filter in between. So we have the negative and the positive hooked up to the solar generator and another thing I like about the PC1 compared to some others is it's got this on off switch it just doesn't automatically kick on another one that we had bought it was a SureFlow, and Ronnie actually had to splice an on off switch in between because um, just like the ability but um, surprisingly now this hose isn't the greatest hose so it's going to have some water sprinkling out of it but um, surprisingly I was surprised how much pressure this had immediately so let's flip it on and there you go that's some serious water coming out through there so we don't want to waste the water but that is definitely some pretty good pressure coming out of there out of this little 55 gallon tank here so we need to get some a hose thing put on there and we should be good to go okay I've got the pump set up I've got a new hose that has a gasket in it and the pump end is uh, pump hose end is in the water in the 55 gallon barrel so I'm going to go ahead and attach the pump to my little power station here my little solar power station and excuse my attire but I've got on my morning garden clothes that I just put on when I'm working out in the garden but we're going to see I'm going to actually water the garden this morning with it And it's not really that loud, so let's see. Oh, yeah. And you can see the corn is drying off. And uh, believe it or not, we are going to have to prepare for a cold front here in Texas. And that's pretty good right there. Look at that. We're expecting a little rain today. But, you know, they always say that, and then we hardly ever get it. So. Very nice indeed. All right. And when we say we're preparing for a cold front here in Texas, don't laugh. It's going to be 91 tomorrow, so that's pretty cold for us. 